Today we'll be talking about the Freer Percussion Stick Holster, here on the Percussion Discussion. The new stick holster from Freer Percussion is a new accessory that's made specifically for their classic card case, which is a case that's made specifically for Tempinus. Uh, if you want to learn a little more about this case, I have a previous video that'll uh, tell you a little more about it and also share my thoughts about it. Uh, now, this accessory is specifically built to expand the number of mallets that your case can hold at any one point in time, uh, not while in storage, but while you're in performance. So that means that you'll have these seven pockets that are on the top, uh, you can lay your mallets down here in the bottom of the case, and now uh, you can have this accessory case which adds yet another five pockets, so another five pairs of mallets uh, that you can use while you're playing. Now in order to attach the holster to your case, all you have to do is lay it across the back of the top or the lid, you're gonna pull these two tabs along the top here and just pull them under the two top pieces of the latches that are on your case. And that's it. It's simple as that to put it on and that's another five sets of mallets that you can actually hold along the top of your case. So a couple of the things that I love about this holster are, number one, that it's flexible. It's made of a soft material, so it's very pliable, very flexible, which means that I can actually just throw it in the case on top of my mallets, close the case down, and I'm good to go. I don't have to have another bag or another holder or anything in order to take this accessory with me. Uh, I can go straight in the case with the rest of my stuff. You can um, either put it on top of the mallets in this bottom compartment, or when I'm not carrying that much music, I've actually managed to put it in the music pouch behind these holsters as well. Uh, so it's very manageable to take along with your case. And then the second thing I love are these gray strips that are along the top of each pocket. Uh, they're actually slightly reflective, so when I'm playing in a dim environment, such as a pit, or if I'm on stage with very little lighting, uh, even a small amount of light, such as from my stand light over my music, will actually reflect off these strips and make them visible to me. Uh, so I always know where to go if I'm A, grabbing a set of sticks, or B, if I'm trying to fit a set of sticks back down in these holsters in conditions that are not exactly optimal. Now, I would absolutely recommend getting this product if you have the uh, Freer Classic Hard Case. Um, it kind of works in a couple of different ways. A, if you just have an insane amount of mallets that you need uh, for a concert, um, perhaps say 10, 15, even 20, uh, this gives you the expandability you need in order to have that many pairs uh, next to you to accomplish that concert. Uh, and B, in the way that I use it more often, is it actually acts as sort of a substitute to laying your mallets on the bottom of the, uh, the timpani case. Uh, oftentimes when I'm using the hard case as a mallet table, uh, I'll have a chair next to my 23 inch chimpano and I'll sit this case in that chair and the mallets will come up just a little bit above the rim so they're very easy to grab and easy for me to see in, uh, in my vision as well. Uh, but having this accessory means that all of my mallets can actually be standing on the top. I don't have some that I have to reach even lower for. Uh, so those are the main two use cases that I see it being the most beneficial in. Now, unfortunately, this accessory is not compatible with classic card cases that were built before 2012. Uh, I believe it has something to do with the latch design on those older cases. Uh, this tab comes around and actually hooks onto a lip on the upper part of the latch on the case. Uh, and I believe that lip that this actually hooks onto is either missing or designed differently, uh, so it's just not able to hang on to those cases. Uh, with that said, though, I do think that there is a way uh, that you can retrofit uh, your older cases in order to make this accessory work, uh, but I would definitely recommend going to Freer's website uh, or contacting them to learn a little bit more about how that works. Thank you for joining me here on the Percussion Discussion. If you have any questions or suggestions, please leave them down in the comment section below. And if you would like to see more percussion-related content like this, go ahead and subscribe and I'll have more content out soon. Take care and goodbye.